Here we have a standard parasternal short axis, or PSSA, view of the heart. Note the location of the indicator dot on the right side of the screen, which means that this image was captured using the cardiology convention, with the probe placed over the third or fourth intercostal space just to the left of the sternum, with the physical probe marker oriented towards the patient's left shoulder. In terms of anatomic orientation of the imaging plane, that would make this anterior, posterior, right hip, and left shoulder. In terms of the cardiac anatomy, this is the left ventricle with the two papillary muscles on either side of the chamber, the right ventricle, and the interventricular septum. The goal of this view is to place the imaging plane perfectly perpendicular to the long axis of the heart, approximately halfway between the level of the valves and the apex of the left ventricle. You'll know you have the correct view when you can see the two papillary muscles side by side within the left ventricular chamber. You should not be able to see any part of the mitral valve from this position. While you won't be able to capture this view in the perfect spot every time, it's important to understand the specific ways in which your interpretation might be skewed in order to avoid being misled by otherwise normal findings. We'll cover these common misinterpretations in another video.